Hi, everybody. Welcome to La Belle Province. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski here in Montreal, Quebec. Calgary's been on such a roll as of late, they almost look invincible these days. You start to get that feeling when they won a game like they did the other night where they probably didn't play as well as they had earlier in the streak. Doesn't matter. They won it anyway. Now they want to continue to push this out. Just moments away from puck drop, both. seem ready to go the Canadians start with possession as we are now underway Calgary's got the puck in their own end this one stopped by the goaltender really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight here he comes in on a breakaway scores wow what a goal nice hands great finish little short break and it's in the net So much goes into this breakaway, and it's happening fast. Are you going to deke? Are you going to shoot? You're reading the goalie's position. He goes to the quick shot, and it's a goal. Gretzky's won the draw here in the open ice. Moves it around along the half wall. And that one's blocked. Here's a shot denied by the defender. Here's an offensive chance. Hammers a shot, and that goes off a player. Rips it, denies him with the save. Really good work in the offensive zone here. Excellent effort. Big stop by the keeper. After the first stop, he's in good position. He scores! What a goal! A couple goals in right around a minute and 50 seconds. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. Really tough for the goalie to read where the heck this thing's going. I'm looking at the shot. I can't tell where it's going, but the backhander beats the goaltender. Calgary's offense is off to a good start here in the early goings. Montreal's won the draw. Scored by number 19, Matthew Kachuk. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the chompers on that play. Oh, brutal open ice hit. Scores! And they are on a roll now, Razor. You can start to see this game's going to run away if this. Goal scoring doesn't slow down here. I can say without question, I never scored from this far away. A point shot? Are you kidding me? That's like shooting it down the block. Calgary's putting on an offensive display here early in the first. Deneau's won the draw. The Canadians pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. And that slides right out to center ice. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Thunderous use of the body on the play. Yeah, sending a message early there, James. He gets the body contact. Scores! Wow, this is unbelievable. Four straight goals. They've dominated this play. The good thing he one times this puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. The Flames are dominating in almost every facet of the game here in the first. Deneau's won it, and now it's grabbed by Mete. Wow! I don't think he saw it. It's a 2 on 0 and can't convert! He's not going to like to see that on the replay, James. Scores! Nice round number for him, James. That's the 50th goal of his career.
I think the goaltender's got to do a better job. There's only one player in front of him. He's got to look around him, find the where the puck is. He never picks it up until it's past him. Calgary's capitalized on their offensive abilities here in this first period. Lemieux's one possession. Sends it over to Myers. And now he moves it quickly to Shen. Picked up along the boards by Lemieux. Players tell us all the time that they don't... He scores! Well, there's 20 for him, James. That's a good milestone to step across. Now, that's a goal scorer's goal right there, James. He establishes position low in the slot and zips the backhander past the goalie. And they're going to mix it up between the pipes here. I'm not so sure the guy coming into the game is going to feel so excited. Their team has just been destroyed tonight. Calgary's taken full advantage of their scoring opportunities with a comfortable lead here in the first. The Flames win it. Puck picked up by Shen. From the left side, takes it at center. Taken along the wall by LaFontaine. Let's it fly! Stick save! I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Hey, he's got 50 goals now. That's pretty satisfying. Halfway to 100 as he looks at the replay of that one. The centermen glide into position. LaFontaine's won the draw here in the offensive zone. That's blocked. Calgary's working the puck near the point. Oh, just inches wide. He doesn't miss it by much, James. That's a really good shot, but he's got to get it on the net. Really liking the way that they're getting after the puck on the forecheck. Oh, makes the save. That was a rocket. He scores! It's always nice to get a bounce. This one hits the pipe, makes the sound, and goes into the net. I think this goalie's going to look up at the clock and see just exactly how much time is melted away. It's going from bad to worse for these guys. Calgary's up here in the first, and they could easily be up by more based on what they've done offensively. The Flames get a hold of the puck off the draw. Taken by Ennis. And he'll take a moment to regroup back at center. Big time save on a big time shot. I always like playing against the goalie that we had traded because I know where he's weak. He thinks he knows where I'm going to shoot. It's kind of a mind game. The Flames win it. Puck grabbed by Shen. Makes the save and putting out the fire in front. Here's a chance. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Hammers it on net. Scores his second of the game. Well, he's been on it tonight. Really good skating legs. He's finished off a couple of plays, too. Everything today is the focus on being quicker, but once in a while, you get to move into a slap shot, and he powders this past the goalie. The Flames came hungry to play this one, and they lead as a result here in the first. Montreal's won the draw in the neutral zone. Scored by number five. Tyler Handles the puck. Assisted by number 16. And now it's grabbed by Shen. It's a three on one. With the blast. And they score. Really quick puck movement always helps when you've got the extra man. The defenders just don't catch up to it, and it ends up in the net. Calgary still got time here in this first period to increase this lead. 
Puck has dropped, and we are back underway. Great hit on the play. The Flames scoop it up along the boards. Number 50. Myers plays the puck. And that goes off a player in front. Montreal's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Interference is the call. Intentions were good, though, I would think. Yeah, but you got to realize I'm in the wrong spot. I can't get in the way like he did. And their first chance to use the man advantage. Key for any team on the power play is to get control of the puck first. So we'll look at the face-off. And this power play, at the very least, has to generate a little momentum. It's their first crack at it tonight. All alone! And scores! On the breakaway! Beautiful! He got out ahead of the pack. And now all that's left is to finish this great opportunity. And he does. Some guys are better than others on breakaway. I think there's a little bit of panic that goes into some guys. He doesn't. He looks really calm here and is able to score. Calgary's offense has been on fire to start this one and still lots of time left in the first. McDonald's won the draw here in the neutral zone. Flurry's got the puck, and he comes up with it. Puck scooped up by McDonald. Blistering shot! Too many bodies in the way. Wow, another shorthanded marker. While they're not laying back at all, they want to kill the penalty, sure, but they've seen something they can take advantage of. Always tough for the goalie to read where the puck's going off the backhand. The Flames have been the better team in this first period. More scoring opportunities, and as a result, more goals. The Canadians win the faceoff. Scored shorthanded by number seven, Brady. Excellent stick work on the play. Kovacu stick handling in his own zone. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. And look at this, it's a pair in all alone. Takes it out of the offensive zone and back to center. Oh, what a stop! When you're the offensive player, it's... He scores! Another shorthanded marker. You don't see that often. No, they're not a very passive group killing penalties, are they? That's a couple of times where they've just taken advantage of a mistake and raced up the ice. Yeah, good luck there, Tender. That thing's in and out so fast, he doesn't even move. The setters will glide into the dot. The Canadians win the draw here in the neutral zone. Fails to find the open man. Calgary's got possession while under man. And he slides it quickly to McDonald. Denies him in front. Quick shot. He scores! Well, this could be something that changes your year around. You get a few bounces like this or you don't get a few bounces like this. The puck's off the post in the net. See, the goalie's hoping for the best here. This shot beats him clean, but it hits the goal post. Unfortunately, it bounces into the net. The Flames have been all over them, and there's still plenty of time left in this first. Montreal's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Makita's going to play it against the half wall. He grabs the puck here at the point. What a steal in his own end. Calgary's here he is in the open. Scores! Whoa! Wow, this is a great reaction, James. He doesn't have much time to finish it off. Makes a perfect shot. Here's the one-on-one -on -one game. The goalie thinks he's going to deke, but he beats him with a quick shot.
the Flames have had way more chances offensively, and as a result, they're leading in this one. Montreal's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Busick. Oh, boy, here comes a three-on-one. Quick shot. Oh, comes up with a stop. The Flames play it near the point. Puck picked up by LaFontaine. Cutting to the front of the net. Oh. He scores! Pretty bold play to get out and score a shorthanded goal. You've really pushed the other team backwards with this marker. He's probably got about two seconds from the time that puck's delivered to find it. He can't see it, so he drops into the butterfly and hopes it hits him. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Face-off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Oh, he rocked him! Just slide to the net. He's got a little jump. He's in the clear. Stones him on the breakaway. Montreal's coaches will... He scores! Sometimes it's just your night. He's got his second goal of the game. This is a good evening for him. Well, he could really shoot the puck there, and that just blows by the goaltender. He didn't really have a chance. Calgary's been the better team here in this first period, and as a result, they've got a big lead. Puck is dropped, play resumes. Here's a chance behind the net. Alex Quick shot, and they score! Minutes, 52 seconds. I don't think the goaltender gets a look at this at all, James. He just drops into the butterfly. He's hoping the thing hits him through that traffic. Calgary's taken advantage of their opportunities offensively so far here in this first. More shots, more goals. Scored by number 12. Says it out right in front. Scores! Oh, what a one-timer to bury it! Time of the goal, 15 minutes, 25 seconds. He didn't waste any time. If he would have stopped that puck, the goalie would have had time to readjust. As it is, it's in the net. The Flames have been the better team so far in this first period. They've had multiple scoring opportunities and as a result have the lead. Montreal's won it. Taken by Petrie. And they fail to go tape to tape. Fleury's taken the puck behind his net. Trying to gain a step. They've got numbers. He scores! Uh, 25 goals is a great number to achieve. That means you've had a solid year. I'm not sure if he was calm at all, James, but he got out in the clear, and he finishes this breakaway off. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. He's 25th of the season. And now it's grabbed by Busick. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Manages to hang on. Flurry, time of the goal, 16 minutes. And he regains control of the puck. The Canadians gain possession along the wall. Made the stop on that play. There's a whistle as the officials calling for a penalty here. The Flames are going to be shorthanded, tripping the call. Played with fire, he got burned, Ray. Oh, he's digging around for the puck, and sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down, and he's got to go to the box. Montreal's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. I hated giving up shorthanded goals. You're on the ice. Lots of times you're 100 feet from the puck when it goes into your own net. But they have to be much better than they were on that attempt. 
moves inside! He got all of that one. The Flames have it in the offensive zone. Came up with the save on that play. No one home on that play. Denies him! He got all of it! They score! This seemed like an inevitability here. Once the delayed penalty arm goes up, it seems like the defending team just fell back on their heels. They didn't do anything really to slow down the opposition. Calgary's offense has been shining brightly so far in this first period. The Flames win possession here in the open ice. Calgary's got a hold of it against the wall. The Flames have it in the offensive end. Calgary's playing it from the side. Keeps hold of the puck. Heads to the back of the net. Maintains possession. Circles back to center ice. Nearing the final 60 seconds here this first period. Across the line from center. The Canadians take possession in the defensive end. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. No one back, a 2 on 0 oh. Scores! Wow, what a goal! Nice hands, great finish. Little short break and it's in the net. It looked like the goalie was expecting a deke. He got back a little deep in the net and the puck beats him with the shot. The Flames lead it here late in this first period. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. And that pass goes awry. From the point, they take control of it. They score! Another short-handed goal! One is impressive. Multiple is just remarkable in the same game. You want money, you go to the bank. You want bread, you go to the store. You want goals, you get into the net. The rebound's there, he puts it away. The Flames have outshot, outscored, and all around dominated here in this first. Calvary's won the draw. Rips it! Oh, he stops him with a glove! Great reflexes there! Time of the goal, 19 minutes, 35 seconds. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession, so key in today's game. The Canadians get a hold of the puck in their own end. Here's a chance to set up now. Well, the man advantage unit might welcome being back at even strength after giving up a shorthanded goal on that power play. He gets that one, too! I'm telling you, James, if you could box that up, that's the way you kill penalties. Not much in your zone, lots of shots on the other team. And there's the horn, mercifully bringing this first period to an end. Willemans Recycling is a proud sponsor of tonight's game. Willamette's Recycling recycles enough paper to save more than 41 million trees. If you'd like to know more about their services, Second period still to come. We'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action. Period number two seems ready to go. The teams are set. My broadcast partner, Ray Ferrar, was also set. Let's do this. Great start for one side and disaster for the other. What does period number two oh, offer? Boy. Let's find out as we're underway here. He scores his hat trick on the night. Uh, what a great night for him. He's had some chances. He's capitalized three times now. And on the road, it feels really good. Really good backhand shot here. He got into the low slot 
and really tough for the goalie to read where that puck's going. Calgary's really shown no signs of concerning their coaches of taking their foot off the gas here, have they? No, they've shot the puck and they've gone and got it. What I like about it, James, they're not settling for easy shots. They're still driving into the middle of the ice. Sends one across! The Flames looking against the half wall. Here's a blast! He scores! Uh, the old double dip makes this a fantastic night for you. You know it's your night. You're feeling it. And now he's got two. That is an absolute laser right past the goalie. He doesn't even make much of an effort on it. The Flames seem to be on the cusp of turning this one into a rout, Ray. They're playing at a different level than their opponents. It doesn't look like there's anything that can slow them down. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? But he came out and challenged him. Good save. Hey, that means the play's supposed to end here. They're still pushing around pretty good. Crowd on their feet as they drop the gloves. Myers is trying to drop the mitts here. He just can't get anyone to fight him. And down he goes. That's a clear winner right there. Maybe this will spark them. Maybe they'll get back in the game, but they're getting blown out here. This might be the first time the crowd's been on their feet in a while. Well, with the chaos cleared, face off now for both teams. Play resumes here as he wins the draw. In he scores! Deuce is wild for him now. Well, that makes your night. I'll tell you, it's great to score one. You get a second one. It's such a rush. Thinking had he yet? Oh, he should be. I mean, he's got two in the bag already. I'll tell you one guy that would be thinking had he, me. The defensive team can't get control of the puck off this face-off. It ends up into the shooter's hands, and he beats the goaltender. The Flames have reminded me of that old cliche here, Ray. When you're hot, you're hot. It's a point night now. Everybody looking for points and goals goal. as they are just clearly the better team tonight. Assisted by number 17. Cutting to the slot. Scores! And that's the hat trick! To get it done on the road is a really special accomplishment. You're dealing with checkers, you're dealing with the line matchup, and it doesn't matter where you are, three is a great night. You got to get into the middle of the ice to score. He's in the low slot and he whips the backhander past the goalie. The Flames are really starting to turn this thing on in a second. They seem a half a step quicker all over the ice. That adds up into a lead that they can extend. Third of the game, scored by number two. Takes the puck on the point. Assisted by number eight. Calgary's got the puck along the boards. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Hammers a shot. That goes wide. He scores again. Well, you get one, you think you might get two, but after a while, you're like, hey, how many can I get? The puck keeps coming to him, and he keeps finishing it off. Oh, well, I guess he couldn't catch up to that one, eh, James? Right past him from the blue line. It just was a rocket. The Flames are back to center, and here in this second period, it's getting out of hand. They've been doing this a lot. Score, go back to center. I guess it's better than being the other way around. Lemuse won the draw. Quick feed to Kachuk. Hammers the one-timer. Oh, an even better save. And another stop. Roy's played poorly. The forwards and defensemen have played. Scores! This is getting insane. It is crazy how often the puck tonight seems to end up on his stick, and then when it's on his stick, it ends up in the net next. What a game. Now, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. Cal 
Calgary's offense firing on all cylinders tonight. Is that fair to say? Yeah, they're going to have to change the netting in that other goal. Man, they are firing the puck in there at will. It's getting frayed. Loses his balance on the play. Picked up along the wall by Shen. And they manage to clear it. Break away. He scores! And a productive season continues to climb. Man, he hasn't had many dips at all. What a nice year he's put together. Once you escape the pack, it's now one-on-one -on -one with the goalie. He's trying to read you. You're trying to read him. The shooter wins this time. Calgary's brought it tonight. They absolutely have dominated here, especially with the goal scoring. They've been faster. They played with more skill. And they are filling the net. What a fun night to play in. Assisted by number 8, Luke Shen. And by number 17, Michael Scarboza. Time of the goal, 5 minutes, 21 seconds. They gain the offensive zone from the middle and couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. From the slot, and that's blocked. Puck grabbed by Ennis. Brilliant save, read it perfectly. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Calgary's got the puck against the half wall. He scores! This might be a where were you moment for so many of these fans. Man, again, he gets a chance on goal and he makes no mistake about it. It's a good thing he one-times this puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. The Flames offense on full display tonight. What impresses you the most? Well, the varied way that they score. I mean, they have just dominated this game. I love the way that they've attacked the net. Scored by number six. Good hit to knock the puck loose. Assisted by number 17. Here he is in front. There it is. There's the hat trick. That puck barely hit the back of the net, James. And his teammates are already up on their feet. Everybody enjoys watching a player get three. That's a good shot. He zips it by the goaltender, but he works himself into a clean area on the ice to shoot this from the high slot. Calgary's on cruise control now. Is that fair to say? It is, and it looks like they're going to try and get another couple of goals here. They're not letting down at all. LaFontaine's won it. By number 17, Michael Scott. Along the half wall with the puck. By number five. With the blast! Turns it aside! Puck scooped up by LaFontaine. Grabbed along the boards by McDonald. Couldn't complete the play. And the puck leaves the zone. Unle he scores! He can't miss tonight! Unbelievable to get this many chances, but to be able to put them all away. I think he almost gave up on this. He can't find the puck, and he just stands there. This thing beats him cleanly. He never saw it. The Flames offensive onslaught continues in the back half of the second. They're not showing any signs of letting off the gas pedal here. This has been a dominant performance. Alex Petrovich. Assisted. Drives to the paint. He scores! Unbelievable rate. Are we watching something historical tonight? It's not over yet. There seems like there's more chances in it for him. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. The Flames continue to apply the pressure, and the offense continues to roll. This is like a steamroller now. It's like nothing will slow them down. Here's a chance to make something happen. It's a 2 on 0 He scores! That's the hat trick! Now, what a great feeling to get three goals in a game. Doing it on the road is a, is a real nice trick. Two seconds.
Some guys find a way to weasel their way into a breakaway. He gets his way. Off he goes. Nobody catches him, and it's in the net. The Flames widen the gap yet again here, Ray. As an offensive player, when these nights happen, you can't get out there fast enough. You think each shift is going to bring you another goal. Quick pass to Connor. And he slides it quickly to Middleton. And a successful clearing attempt. Cuts into the paint. Scores. That's three. I had nine of these, James. It is such a cool thing to score three. You feel so good about yourself. Now that's a goal scorer's goal right there, James. He establishes position low in the slot and zips the backhander past the goalie. Calgary's offensive onslaught continues. What are you seeing down at ringside, Ray? Domination. They've been the better team for most of this night. Now they're in such a large lead, it's very comfortable. His third of the game, scored by number Gretzky's 10. got it along the wing. Assisted by number nine. Myers has the puck against the half wall. Here's a blast, and too much traffic in front blocks that one. Stays with it. He scores! Not very often in today's game you get enough room to take the slapper anymore, but he hammers this past the goalie. The Flames continue to pour it on here in the back half of this second period, Ray. All they want to do is get this to the intermission in the shape they're in. They're very comfortable now. Puck picked up by Shen. Booming shot! He gets a piece of it with a stick! Myers gets a shot on goal. He's been in the box serving a five-minute major for the last little while. The Flames lead in a big way here in this second. They have been on fire offensively. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Slides it quickly to Myers. He was locked in there. Good crowd here tonight, Razor. Uh, they've been close to this. Uh, it is a sellout. It's been a long slog to get the people to the building, but they're all here tonight. Calgary's lead here in the second period, a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively. And scores! You get one, you want to think about a second one. It doesn't matter if you're at home or on the road, but you do this on the road, you feel a great accomplishment. And there's the one hat that he gets for scoring on the road. The goalie's barely in position here. That puck is snapped back so quickly, he can't react to the shot. The Flames clearly aren't a fan of any mercy rule tonight, are they? Now, when it's your night, though, go and enjoy it. You got a few goals, go get a few more. There's going to be some nights that it doesn't happen like this. Taken by Ennis. With possession along the wall. And he makes the save. Scooped up along the wall by Kovacu. Drills him with the blast. He does it again. Put that stick away, man. Is it hot? What an outstanding game. He powders this shot. Good speed. Really good play to get into the open ice and to find a clean lane all the way to the net. Calgary's been in simple attack mode all night long. Would you not agree? Yes, and the opponent has no answer. It's like they can't get up to speed to take any of the pace away. A uh, howitzer scores! You get one, you get hungry for a second one. Even if you're not a goal scorer, you get that early. Now you want to hunt for a second goal. Makes it a double on the play. Oh, this shot beats him clean here, but he doesn't see it. I think he's got to work a little harder. There's only one person in front of the net. He shouldn't be screened so completely. The Flames are starting to make people lose track of just how wide this lead is now. 
Busiest guy in the rink is the guy changing the numbers on the clock. Man, they are awesome tonight. Number 50, Tyler Myers. Calgary's got him along the wall. From the point, looks to make something happen. Lemieux on the attack in the offensive zone. And now it's grabbed by Myers. Calgary's in transition. Gets the puck in deep. Picked up along the boards by Lemieux. Puck grabbed by Shen. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Shen's tendency is to shoot the puck. This time he overhandles it and loses it. Well, a challenge being laid here. Yeah, that was a big hit. And now the other team feels like they've got to jump in and challenge him, so they're going to go. Oh, and down to the ice he goes. That's the end of that spirited boat. Oh, that was a pretty good tilt. I would say the energy in the building's gonna sag a little bit here. Their guy didn't do so well. Another special teams opportunity for both sides as the man advantage unit is back to work again. Way too many of five minute power plays just kind of fade into the ether. There's not enough urgency. They don't attack like they normally would on a two minute power play. Cuts to the front. Oh, what a move. Take it along the wall by Kobasu. The Flames will play it from the point. Puck scooped up by LaFontaine. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. LaFontaine's in good shape here, but he ends up losing the puck and overhandle. Nearing the 40-minute mark of the game. And that puck leaves the zone. Picked up along the wall by Fleury. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. The Flames get a hold of it. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Grabbed along the boards by Shen. Oh, he goes between the legs! Puck picked up by Kachuk. Drives to the sweet spot! Answered the call there. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Calgary's looking to break out. The Flames break out of their own end with one last chance. Taken by Byron. And now it's grabbed by Makita. Oh! Devastating hit on the play. Sometimes, James, you think you got more time than you do. There was no room left. That looked painful. His reflexes on display tonight. Calgary's been dominating at all ends of the ice, especially offensively here late in the second. Montreal's got it in the defensive zone. There's the horn ending period number two. Might almost be a mercy rule in some ways. Do you know someone in your community who goes the extra mile to help out? Nominations for our team player awards are available in the concourse in the lower seating level. Don't go anywhere. Third period is coming up, and it's coming up next. The officials made his way to center, and this third period is about to go. Calgary's penalty killers welcome that intermission and they get things going on the right note, winning the draw. Scooped up along the wall by Petrovich. Montreal's looking to break out of their own end. And the power play unit comes up empty on that one. Well, the two minutes slides by pretty efficiently. I like their penalty kill group mainly because they were so aggressive. And as a result, they actually ended up with a lot of shots on net. Puck grab by Kobasu. Moves up near the blue line and looks to set up at the point. And that goes wide of everything. And not much on that one. The Flames have it against the wall. And there's the save.
Calgary's offense has been a thing to watch tonight as they lead it big time here early in the third. Lemieux won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Unleashes a cannon off target. Steps into it. He scores! That's three on the night. It doesn't matter where it is either. The hat trick is always an unbelievable feeling. They're so hard to come by. Once you get a stick on it, it is total chaos for the goalie. It's reaction. It's luck. He couldn't catch up to that one. Calgary's added to their lead here in this third period. It's been nonstop. I like how they've scored and then gone after the next one, James. They've had their foot down on the gas pedal the whole night. Puck scooped up by Flurry. Moves it quickly. Scores. Brady Kachuk. Time of the goal, two minutes, 55 seconds. It's really good work offensively as they grind away till that opening shows up. And that's the one-timer from the low slot. Puck picked up by Petrie. Slides Whoa. across to Middleton. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. The Flames have been in the perfect position, it seems, all night. There's another intercepted pass. Calgary's gained possession along the boards. Taken along the wall by Kachuk. Moves the puck along the half wall. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Taken by Lemieux. Here's a chance. And now it's grabbed by Makita. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And the puck Whoa. skips away after that move. Between his legs. Dangles between his legs. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Calgary's got a hold of it along the wall. And the puck departs the zone. Taken by Flurry. Puck grabbed by Middleton. Calgary's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Here's a chip. He's got a step and can't convert. Can't convert, James. He doesn't even get a shot. He might as well dump it in the corner and keep the forecheck going. And he easily stops that one. New York's on the calendar next. That should be a fun one. It should be. The teams play generally pretty aggressive physical games against each other. Deneau's won a big draw on their own end. Another no. crash. No surprise here, James. He's been doing this since about 7 o'clock tonight. Time after time. The Flames will play it from the defensive zone. Here's a chance, a 2 on 0 Oh, what a stop! Goalie keeps his nose right over top of the puck to handle that deke to make the save. Oh, what a move! Oh, he goes between the legs! Just wide! Stepping out of the crease now to play the puck. Bartosek, and look at this, he's ready to go! Oh, I love it. When the goalies get involved, there's always something a little comical about it. I'll never understand how two guys at opposite ends of the ice can get to this point, but the crowd seems to love it. This, James, is peer pressure. It's amazing how the energy in the building can seep away when your guy doesn't do so well in the fight. Yeah, you can hear a pin drop in this arena now. A little four-on-four -four hockey as both teams step inside the face-off circle. This is the time, James, you get your skill guys into the game more frequently. Four-on-four -four is open ice. It's danger if you have skill, and the team with the most skill is probably going to be the best. All alone! Yeah, that wasn't very good. It looked like he was going to deke, and then he was going to shoot, and then he didn't either. Oh, what a hit! Fires it into the offensive zone. Myers has it at center ice. Look out, here's a 2 on 0 oh, and that falls apart. I can tell you one play that won't be on his highlight reel. <laughs> Not that one. The Canadians take it along the wall. Oh, set that hit up perfectly. Here he is, in close! 
The Canadians will play it in their own end. My goodness, what a hit! You don't see hits like that anymore. The game goes so fast, but the defender got into great position and delivered wow. a devastating hit. Well, that's got it in the defensive zone. Trying a physical line here. He scores again! Well, you get one, you think you might get two, but after a while, you're like, hey, how many can I get? The puck keeps coming to him, and he keeps finishing it off. Not much chance for the goalie here. That turnover's burped up and now given right to the other team. They get to reload their offense, and they take advantage. Top bins into the net. The Flames could almost put this one in neutral here for the rest of this third period. They've dominated much of this game, and the score is clearly reflective of that. Oh, did he eat that hit? This is a good time to be retired. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Calgary's got control of the puck. The Flames go to work on offense. Comes out to play the puck. Calgary's got it along the wall. The Flames gain possession in their own end. And look at this, a three-on-one. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Calgary's laying a pounding on the opposition tonight, generating numerous scoring chances and converting on what feels like almost all of them. Puck scooped up by Myers. That pass doesn't go. And look at this. It's a pair in all alone. And can't convert. He's not going to like to see that on the replay, James. He doesn't even get a shot off. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. website for more details. Uh, you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. No one back, a 2 on 0 Huge stop on the breakaway. Oh, you don't get many of these. He's right in on goal, but the goalie's better. Again, let's rolling along on his point streak. You know he wants it to keep going. The Flames have been the aggressor offensively tonight as they continue to lead in the third. Scarposis won the draw. Fires it just wide. Nobody's going to be able to block that unless they're way off target like his shot was. Denies him again. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Cal put in one of their most complete efforts that we have seen in quite some time up big time late in this third. Picked up along the boards by Toffoli. Jostling for the puck and it's knocked away. Hammers it, puts it in, and it's a shorthanded goal! Oh, this is a really devastating strike to give up. You're on the power play, you think you're gonna get a goal, and now all of a sudden, you've gotta come up with another one just to erase that. Grabs the puck at center. Moves it to Toffoli. And he takes a shot, and that carries off a stick. 15 minutes, nine seconds. Moving into the attacking zone. Wow, another shorthanded marker. Well, they're not laying back at all. They want to kill the penalty, sure, but they've seen something they can take advantage of. He doesn't need too many chances to score. That's one of the reasons he leads his team in goals. He's got a great finish when he gets the opportunity. The Flames have really been strutting their offensive prowess. You've been impressed tonight? I really have. They can put it on cruise control now. A large lead here in the third period. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back.
thunderous hit on the play. Calgary's across the blue line. Break away, and that fizzles out. I'm not sure what his intention was going to be there, James, but he ran out of real estate. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. The Canadians take it along the wing. The Flames scoop it up along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Shen. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Let's see what the officials say. Pretty cut and dry trip on that play. Coaches will tell you, be careful with your stick, but you're trying to get the puck. I yep. don't think a lot of times they do it intentionally. Makita's won the draw here in the offensive zone. And he denied that opportunity. The Flames play it along the boards. It's a three on one between his legs from behind the net. Grabbed along the boards by Petrovich. The Flames slide the puck near the point. Sets up from Gretzky's office. Dangles between his legs. That's off a stick. Scooped up along the wall by Petrovich. And a poke check knocks the puck away. The Canadians gain control of it. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. And takes a tour out of the offensive end to find some space at center. Made the stop on the play. The Flames wanted to focus on putting more pucks on net going into tonight's game. They have done just that and then some here in the third. The Canadians win it in the defensive zone. Takes control Whoa. of the puck. They've got numbers. Oh, what a move. And he blocks that one. The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Take it along the wall by Kobasu. The Flames work it around near the back end. Puck picked up by LaFontaine. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Aaron pass and the play is broken up. What a shot, he scores! Oh man, the goalie thought he had this covered, James. You can tell from his body language, but it beats him, hits the post, and goes in. Everybody always stops for a quarter of a second when a puck hits the post. This time it bounces in. The Flames are in cruise control here, but they're showing no signs of letting up. No, the lesson began about two hours ago, and it's not Flames class out yet. Grabs control of it at the point. Boom! Hangs on to the puck. It's a 2 on 0 Whoa! Scores! There it is! The big 4 Oh! You don't get very many years that go this good. So when you get a chance to finish this off, you want to bang in your milestone goal. He's so calm on this breakaway. He's got his head up the whole way. He picks his spot, snaps it by the goalie. Calgary's on fire tonight, and they show no signs of slowing down in the third. This has been almost a perfect hockey game for them. When they look at the video, they're going to be really happy. Another big hit! Man, this guy has one color on his mind, and it's the other team's jersey. Skate, hit, skate, hit. It's been that all night. The Canadians certainly didn't get the result they wanted on that power play, giving up a shorthanded marker. What a stop! They're not going to be too thrilled when they get a look at the film on that power play ineffective and maybe more importantly they give up the shorthanded goal calgary's gonna play it from the corner quick feed down low and that's picked off in front the flames are in the home stretch of this one leading big time in the third makita's won the draw deep in the defensive zone Here's an offensive chance. Takes a blast, and that's blocked. Roy's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. The Flames lead it late in this third period.
Calgary's got it in the offensive zone. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Scores! You can see he's looking on both sides of the traffic, trying to find the puck. When he finally catches up to it, he waves at it, a big move, but doesn't catch it. Calgary's lamp lighting performance continues here with another goal in the third. They can walk home. They have dominated this third period. They've stretched the lead out into a really comfortable margin. Turns it away. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. Time of the goal, 19 minutes, 25 seconds. The centermen glide into position. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive oh, zone. Man. Blocked in traffic. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. The Canadians take over on possession. Picked up along the boards by Mete. Oh, 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 he got absolutely walloped on that one. Did he ever? I mean, he didn't have his head up, and the player ran right over top of him. Calgary's relentless physical play has helped them get the lead in this game. The Flames have pummeled their opponents tonight. They have been the busier team offensively and have converted numerous times here in this third period. And the shutout streak will continue with just seconds away from adding yet another goose egg. And that'll do it here tonight for this one. McDonald's hat trick leads the way in the victory, Ray. Got himself into good position to shoot the puck tonight. He was in front of the net. He was a dangerous player all night long. Hooray, Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us, everybody. Have a great night.